I'm uh, Vivian Tan from Western Sydney University. My research is on sustainable constructions and mostly related to life cycle analysis, green building and recycled concrete. For um, apart for this project, I'm using the innovations of CO2 concrete. In general, that we are actually when we have the old building, we damage the old building and then we crush it, become recycled aggregate. Most of the time, we're just reusing recycled aggregate to produce recycled concrete with the other ingredients. But the problem is the strength actually will, will reduce. CO2 concrete is actually injecting carbon dioxide into the recycled aggregate to produce that we call as CO2 concrete. The strength has been matching, and not only about the performance, performance has been matched and also the cost has been reduced as well. I'm using the concrete to be applied into the industry. At the moment with the university, with the Western Sydney University support, the, we have already put pour some of the concrete for the university. The first one that we done is last year, March 2018, that we done a, a small foot bath, which is about 40 by 50 centimeters, which is not too big, but it is um, for um, people to enter and exit the farm and then they, had, they can actually clean the boots. But recently, that this year, March, we actually upgraded the scale of the production of the CO2 concrete. They already become three meters by three meters slabs. And what we are using it for, for the cow on top to put a cow drinking station on top and then the cow will be standing on top to drink it. And that's why it's, a, it's like a weight test because it's about, each cow is about a ton each, a ton weight. And then for five, six cows that you can actually on top of the slab, it's going to be a weight test for that. Yeah, that's how we are doing at the moment, but we are still looking forward to further progressing with um, some partnering with some industry as well. What I can see is because um, research is, is mainly about publishing papers at the beginning, and then we'll actually look into how can we get some funding to build up our research teams. But at the moment, with a lot of Australian government that um, push, we're actually looking into really impacts. I really hope to make this project to make even further impacts. Uh, at this stage that we are looking into a um, patent, we're looking into the provisional patents and then after that we, we can actually try to push it to the Australian market to use it and then we're also looking into some international market as well.